Welcome back to Orange Hat Reviews, everyone. I seem to have been mistaken. When I did a video about Zoe Kravitz being cast as Catwoman, I had reported that it was not agenda-driven. But I want to give a big shout-out to Mary Jade on Twitter, OG Mary Jade. for setting the record straight with me. She actually has been against it, and I gave her my opinion, and then she's like, no agenda. And then she showed me this thing here. It is a little uh, snippet from an interview, or a report. Kravitz's name has been mentioned in a rumor back in September. The rumor from Heroic Hollywood indicated director Matt Reeves was looking for a person of color or mixed race to play Catwoman along the lines of Zoe Kravitz. So, yeah, I was wrong. And that video is not going to be deleted, but I will put down in the comment section below that there is a correction to be made. It sucks that the Batman movie with or from Matt Reeves is looking to be agenda driven. I wish that Hollywood would stop committing token racism every time they do this. Because that is exactly what they're doing. When you cast on based on skin color, you are doing a disservice to people of color. You are putting them up on a pedestal and telling people to throw money at their skin color. Do you? Does Hollywood not see how wrong that is? Does Hollywood not see how this was done in the past? It's disgusting, folks. And I'm sorry. Now that this information has come out, that Reeves was looking for a person of color to portray Catwoman, and it wasn't based on casting merit, and it wasn't based on casting skill, I am against it. Sure, Zoe Kravitz has some acting talent, but if she is simply being cast for her skin tone, then I am against that kind of thing. And I am against that kind of thing, and always will be against that kind of thing. Because it is tokenism. You are basically using a person for their skin color. You're not using them for their talent. You are not using them for their skill in acting. You are casting them based on their skin color. And that is what pisses me off. You weren't casting them based on skill or merit. You were casting based on the color of their skin. I'm sorry, folks. To me, that's an evil practice. To me, that is nothing but token racism. And I think anybody in Hollywood that thinks that being white in Hollywood is such a bad thing and having white people in movies is such a bad thing nowadays and staying consistent with comic established characters is a bad thing. Well, I think that you all are what's wrong with Hollywood. And I think that people who are calling for forced diversity need to wake up and smell reality and actually live in reality and see it for what it truly is, which is tokenism. Anyway, folks, that's the video. I wanted to set the record straight. I want to maintain integrity on my channel. So if I do have to make a correction, I do or retractions and I do correction videos. So yeah, this was a correction video. Anyway, y'all know the drill. Like, comment, subscribe, share, all that jazz. Let me know down in the comments below what you think now that the truth is out. It wasn't based on merit. It was based on the color of her skin. Do you think Zoe Kravitz should actually feel proud that she's being cast as Catwoman simply because, or simply because she has a darker skin tone? Or do you think she should be honored because she's playing Catwoman?
Let me know down in the comments below what you think. This has been Orange Hat Reviews. And I'll catch y'all on the next one.